Hey guys, welcome to Shuji P Reels. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a character in Adobe Fuse, then transfer it to Blender, do some modification, prepare it for the Unreal Engine 4. So this is their website, adobe.com products fuse.html. You can download it from there. Um, once you download it, uh, sometimes, actually most of the times, you're going to have difficulties opening the file because it's still in beta case. So one thing you can do is you can select the icon on your desktop, then hold enter until you see a loading screen for the fuse. See the loading screen. There you go. So as you can see, uh, it opened a bunch of them, right? So you have to be careful. Like I know you can close most of them, but um, you know, you don't have to keep them all open. I'm going to close most of them and keep only three. All right, so this is how it looks like, right? So I'm gonna quickly create a character. Um, I'm going to create, let's say, male scan three, three. I'm gonna choose the same scan. So I think it was three, three, and that's about it. So this is how the character looks. This is how the character looks. I'm going to put on some clothes. I'm going to, I'm not going to go into details, but I'm going to put on some clothes. So you have, you know, if you go to clothing, you will see a lot of options. Um, so for example, you can the, you can try this trans code, then go to bottoms. I have a lot of options as you can see, because you can add more plugins, more options. Like if you have more clothes, you can buy from the asset store. Um, and you can put on maybe dress pant with that right okay and then shoes maybe i don't know um maybe boot maybe this okay and then we can try maybe okay here here could be um not a lot of options but let's see if this here works all right this looks fine um then we have hat hat we can choose maybe this uh, i don't know uh maybe this something like that i mean you know i don't know i wouldn't see a lot of options maybe this fedora yeah yeah there you go so you can also um let's see what else so yeah i have a lot of options i have beard as well you can choose beard uh, I think you have gloves as well, right? See gloves. Um, you have you have uh, what else? What else you have? You have um, mustache. There you go. Now you have full beard. Um, all right. So let's say I'm happy with the clothing, right? Uh, so what I can do, you can go to texture, right? now here's the thing you want to save your save your uh, character okay so let's save it um i'm going to save it um demo let's say demo one i'm going to save it so in case it crashes it does crashes uh so now if um, once you're in texture you can click on the individual uh, cloth and you can i recommend that you increase the uh, texture resolution um so first thing i'm going to change i'm going to click on uh, i'm going to remove the glove okay I don't, i'm not going to use that so i'm going to click on skin as you see it's going to say like general parameters mix, uh, mix ammo body substance so texture resolution is, is is at 1k i'm going to i'm going to increase it to 2k uh, you can do um you also want to have to do uh individual beard and mustache um 2k beard mustache 2k uh hair 2k all right now cloth it can go up to 2k um but it will crash this is experimental i think you can enable that in edit preferences uh what else i say so if you go to uh edit preferences and you click on this checkbox hello 2k clothing texture experimental you can if you choose that it's going to show up for clothing 
but I'm not gonna choose 2K because most of the times it crashes. So for this, I'm gonna for the clothing, I'm gonna stay with 1K. So I'm gonna choose all the clothing and press 1K. Uh, what else? I have pant and shoes. 1K. 1K. And that's that's pretty much it. Let's save it. Uh, you can mm, change the colors now. Um, let's change. Let's change it. Now, what you want to do after you're happy with that, uh, what you're going to do is uh, send to Mixamo. Okay, I'm going to click on that. It's going to show up, save, and then it's going to take a while to um, load it. There you go. So our character is ready. Looks nice, right? Pretty cool. Um, so what do you want to do? Facial blend spaces. Enable it. Don't touch anything else. Update the rig. All right, so I think it's ready. I'm not going to, it's everything is uh, facial brand spaces enabled. Skeleton LOD is standard Skeleton 65. So I'm going to finish it. I think it's the order ringing, ringing is done. Finish it. Use this character. Download, okay? So you can either download uh, or animate. It, it will take you to the um, mix demo character space. If you click here, it's going to take you to the animation space. So I'm going to download it. Uh, the format is going to be F FBX and the post is going to be T post. Download it. All right, so that's another thing. All right, so I have downloaded. So that's another thing I have to do. I sh maybe I should do it right now, uh, so that we don't have to use this uh, Adobe Fuse anymore. Uh, so you have the character, right? So what we want to transfer the uh, tra uh, texture. So go to File, Export, then Export Textures. Uh, you don't have to select any specific cloth, uh, it will do it for everything. So since we're going to use Unreal 4, so click on Unreal 4. Um, and my folder is characters, I'm going to say uh, export in new folder. So it will create the folder called demo1. And so and this is it, I'm going to click OK. So it's going to export the texture, exporting the textures. So we're not going to use the uh, the blender material. So we're going to create our own materials in Unreal Engine 4. 